All right, I'm going to teach you how to change your computer's processor and clean your computer's heat sink. But first, you're going to need a screwdriver. You're going to need to disconnect the power cord so you don't kill yourself. All right, now we get started. First, you want to open up the case. Then, you find the fan, which is right here, the one on your motherboard, which is this one. Your, process, your processor is located right under the fan. What this fan does is that it takes the heat away from your processor when you're surfing the web or when you're playing games. Alright, so I'm going to grab the screwdriver. And there are four screws, so you have to unscrew them first. And remember, if you screw to the left, then the screws get looser. So, you want to screw to the left. I'm doing this with one hand, so it's kind of hard. Alright, I'm going to put the camera down so I can finish this quicker. So, just wait. All right, I had the second one. We're getting on the third one right now. When you're doing this, you want to make sure your screwdriver isn't like magnetic because then it can ruin your computer's hard drive and power supply. Alright, I'm on the last one. Alright, I took all four screws off. Now before you pick up the fan, you want to disconnect the line connected to the to your motherboard, which is right there. I don't know if you can see it, but you're, you're going to have to pull that out. But remember which one you pull it out from, so that way when you screw it back in, you can you have to plug this thing in in order for it to work. Alright, after that, just gently lift it up. You might have to wiggle it a little. All right, here it is. I picked up the fan, and you can clean the fan in the inside so that way, you know, it can breathe better and let out the air better. Just take a vacuum and vacuum that. All right. Anyways, here is the processor. This is a LG A775 socket, and on top of the processor, it looks sort of dirty because that's the thermal paste that they put on. Alright, so I'm just going to go ahead and open up the socket. After you've opened up the socket, gently pick up the processor. Don't touch the prongs on the bottom because if you get any dirt in them, then it'll fry up the processor. Anyways, here's the processor. That's the processor. Now in this case, I'm not really putting in a new processor. I'm just showing you how to, you know, put one in if you're gonna upgrade your computer's processor, or if you want to clean the heat sink. All 
Alright, so I'm gonna go ahead and put that back in. Also, when you put it back in, make sure there's an arrow on the processor, and make sure it's lined up with the arrow on the motherboard. Drop it in. Alright. Close the socket. Pick up the latch. Put it down. <laughs> and when you're installing a liquid cooler, what a liquid cooler is, is that inst instead of having this fan here to take out the heat from the processor, you're gonna, instead of this fan, you're gonna have a liquid cooler on top of the processor instead of the fan, so that way it can cool, it can cool off your processor better. Now I'm going to go and put this back in. Make sure you line up all the screws the right way. I got it. Now I'm just gonna put the screws back in. Alright, I had the first one done. On to the second one. After you put the screws back on, just plug it back, just plug the line back into the motherboard. Then just close the case. And that's how you change a, a processor.